In today's video, I'm going to be talking about the five most repeated topics in chemistry jam exam that always show faces at the end of every exam. This video is going to be talking about the five most repeated topics in jam chemistry exam. So let's go. Hi, I'm AY and this is Prima Medicate. The first topic I want to talk about is metal and its compound. Now, you may think it's a very, very bulky topic, but if you're able to do well to sit with it and master it very well, talking about group one, group two, group three metals that are um, metals, talk about transition metals and those kind of topics. Once you're able to dissect them and you're able to understand them, you shouldn't have a problem because trust me, they are always repeated in jam exam year in, year out. So you don't want to be left out. The second topic which I want to speak about is, of course, the popular organic chemistry, organic chemistry one, organic chemistry two. The reason why I split it to be organic chemistry one and organic chemistry two is because of the way it is in our textbook. Now, organic chemistry one is talking about alkanes, alkynes, alkanes, homologous series, and the rest of them like that. Why organic chemistry two goes to the advanced level where you talk about alkanoids, carbonhydrates, proteins, polymers. I want you to go and take study those topics because trust me, you can't escape organic chemistry when doing your jam exam as a chemistry student. The third topic which I want to speak about is solubility. Now, solubility and particularly stoichiometry. Now, the reason why I'm choosing these topics is because these topics are very, very content because they are calculations. Solubility, calculation, stoichiometry calculations, talk about mass, mass, mass volume, and those kind of um, questions that you see. The number of moles, number of grams, and those kind of things. You need to study them because they are very, very useful. And if you are able to integrate them with gas laws also, you will have a good preparation. You have a good test start because gas laws, stoichiometry, solubility, they are all calculations. So doing well to study the calculations that are in your chemistry will also help you have a good start. Remember, I call them stoichiometry, solubility, and gas laws. So that is the third topic that is mostly repeated in jam chemistry. The fourth topic is non-metals and their compound. Very, very similar to metals and their compound. Very bulky, but if you are able to sit down with them and study them individually, hydrogen and its compound, oxygen and its compound, chlorine and its compound, nitrogen and its compound, phosphorus and its compound, but able to study those topics, then you will have a very, very good knowledge of what non-metals and their compounds are, their preparation, their compounds, their chemical properties, physical properties, and even their uses. It's going to help you a lot because they are always very, very repeated in jam when it comes to chemistry. The last topic which I want to talk about is air and water. Now, they are actually two separate topics, but they actually bring them together because it's something you can read at a go. When you read about air, you read about air and air pollution, you read about air purification, you read about why air is a mixture and not a compound, you read about water, you read about the purification of water, you read about the distribution of water, you read about the properties of water, you read about the hardness of water, temporary hardness, permanent hardness, and other topics like that that can also aid your studies as you're preparing for your JAMP exam. You know that the JAMP mock exam is fast as hand and I want you this video to reach out to those that are doing their jam work exam because I wish you a very very good exam and I wish you a very very wonderful result so if you're part of those that are studying mock exams and drop a comment in the comment section and um, we would like to hear from you if you have any questions we'd like to hear from you if you have any questions relating to jam or any topic in science subjects you can reach out to me in the comment section or check my links in the description below because I'm going to be dropping links where you can actually reach me on a personal level so we could actually discuss but for now these five topics in jam exam i want you to take them serious metals and its compound um non-metals and its compound organic chemistry one and two stoichiometry solubility and gas laws and then air and water thank you very much thank you for listening to me in this video do well to subscribe to this channel if you are liking the kind of content we are dropping because we'll see you in the next video peace